Oh, hi guys, how are you doing? So basically, we're trying to do um up guard keep. To be honest, I think I just um wipes on this and. Problem is, I pulled an awful lot of mobs, and apparently they do a sort of area of effect thing. Which is really unpleasant. Also, you know what, I'm just going to use one of my, um... Bots of Endless Rage and just eat food. Because these guys seem pretty tough. I mean, most of the, um, Heroic Dungeon Plus seem... Kind of hard, you know, they've all got very really annoying tactics. And if these guys have got horrible sort of... Um, damaging effect on the floor... Well, okay... That's my um, gun anyway. It's gonna pull back here. Look, stop charging in! Ah! Uh. Wow. Look, this is oh, really annoying me. Sorry, you guys could see that I was, like, trying to pull back. Oh, my gosh. These guys respawning. That was kind of crazy. I have to say, I'm really. I don't know. Not used to some of this, but. Stop! Oh my gosh, sorry. Drat, what am I doing? We can probably skip these to be fair, but... Ah... Uh. Oh, I see the ice things on the floor, right. Right, so that's the tactic in here, guys. These guys have um, appalling uh, sort of floor ice. I don't know if the floor ice also builds up or something. Well, we only wiped once, so... Uh, I guess we're going to have to kill them, actually. So yeah, I'm just cutting these guys around anyway. Wow. 
Wow, this is going to be quite a long dungeon, I think. The rate at which these guys are going down. I think uh, we accidentally pulled or picked up two kind of healers, so one of them's kind of gone off spec, I think. Uh, which is uh, fine. Nothing wrong with that. I don't know. I was trying to get like non sort of melee or non um, hunters in here because I kind of wanted better chances of a ring. But uh, we'll sort of see what happens. I'm going to leave it as an open roll. Ooh, I wonder if these do the frosty ice thing as well. Kite we'll him down here. Hmm. So the drakes don't seem too bad. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I'm going to pull them this way for a bit. Oh no, 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 they're, um... That was very close, almost like... Threw the guy into that of a mob over there. Let's just kill this dragon. Maybe we can skip, I don't know, but... I don't want to pull too many of them and end up wiping again, that'd be kind of embarrassing. You know, it is probably kind of funny, but um, I guess it'd be kind of weird if a search needle ring didn't even drop and we we're all sort of talking about it and stuff. But yeah, it's um, something I actually kind of want because it's one of a few like upgrades um, kind of in the game, which um, you can kind of get from me daily dungeons. So it'd be really nice to have it, actually. And um, the other thing is, right, <clears throat> I always try to build my character's armor out to, uh... Oh! No, 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 no! Oh, I'm so sorry. Didn't mean to, obviously. Give him a chance to sort of drink up. Yeah, I mean, these, um... Hero Plus dungeons are kind of good, but the problem is... They're kind of not very chill, whereas before they were, like... You know, pretty chill. You could just go in and you could just... I don't even know why I'm doing, um... Battle Shout. <laughs> I'm the only um, sort of DPS here. I suppose it actually helps the Warlock, um, the Warlock pet a little bit, but... Oh no, 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 where's my intervene? There it is. But it's kind of useful sometimes. Again, I don't know what I'm going to... All of them going to be pulled. Yeah, it's going to pull all of them.
I think I need to get more attack power, to be honest, because... Oh no, I'm just killing everyone. You know, it's a good thing we get some like bonus money, you know, for this, because um <laughs> I guess we're gonna pretty much need it at the end of this. I don't know. Maybe I should have focused my Ali is the main tank, but it's difficult when you're in a raid, because if um, off-spec stuff falls, then, you know, you can't obviously send it to an alt, which is kind of annoying. But... Ah. Your blood is mine. Oh, it's too late now. So, again, I don't know what this guy does. I know he ordinarily um, summons some skeletons and stuff, so I'll probably go pick them up. First time in here on um, Heroic Class, whatever it's called. To be fair, some of the bosses are kind of makes bags because because you've got a load of um, like unstable elements added in. You've got like no idea how they're all going to interact with each other. Like I was in the Nexus the other day. I don't think I uploaded the video, but basically the boss got so many duplicates of herself. <laughs> it was just like almost impossible to do anything with it. Oh, that's a nice necklace. I keep seeing this amazing stuff dropping, which I would love on, you know, my mage or pally. But yeah, I'm just going to vendor it, which is kind of sad. Used to be able to enchant it. At least on the positive side, I've got about 500 gold just doing two dungeons so far. So, not bad. I mean... You know, I'm so glad these um, casters can take like one or two hits because we'd be pretty, pretty doomed. <laughs> I always feel sorry for these guys, these um, ghouls. Are we skipping? I don't know, they kind of just shield their heads and stuff. They always kind of feel like they don't really want to be in here. You know, I was listening to um, Meta Goblin the other day, and Meta Goblin kept going on and on. To be honest, um, wasn't really impressed about how classic players aren't, you know, very skilled compared to retail. And I mean, I've kind of heard this before. And I mean, I did play retail for quite a long time, um, especially on some of the harder dungeons. And I kind of think they're kind of talking nonsense, maybe. Because for a start, you don't know, like, what the entire skill of the player base is. And, I mean... Yeah, maybe the older game is slightly more, you know, casual-friendly, which is kind of weird, because it always feels like... Retail Warcraft's way more classic-friendly. It's a lot easier to level up. You know, you just literally play the game on autopilot and you can pretty much get to where you want to go if you just put enough time in. 
Um, to be honest, the PvP was really good. But yeah, I mean... I don't know if you're kind of constantly denigrating your audience by saying, Ooh, they're not as good. I don't know. I certainly turn the video off. I don't want to listen to that nonsense. The thing is, um, there is also an argument for against being basically min-maxed to um, to the absolute maximum. Like, you know, we know the tactics, we know what to do, um, people have done a lot of research. But, you know, that's kind of kind of being a bit of an expert in, in a funny sort of way, which, you know, is its own kind of skill. I'm just going to wait for him, guys. All right, yeah, so we got the coin. Ordinarily, that guy isn't there, but it's kind of there for, like, the Night Elf slash Torrent version of um, Chinese New Year. Which is kind of cool. Um, you know, you may as well complete the quest. Also gives you some very nice um, horde reputation, which, for some reason, I've been playing this character for years. You would have thought I would have maximum horde reputation, but... Horde rep's really good because it gives you rep with every faction, as in, you know, the original factions. So yeah, you're only getting 75, but it actually counts as 300 or 350, I don't know. Don't do too much damage, guys. That's for all, okay? Poor old warrior can't keep up. <laughs> Ugh. I don't want to get overwhelmed here. Right, that was fine. One at a time is fine by me. Oh, we've got the bosses now. To be so, I never know which order to kill him in, to be fair. Um... It can be a bit tricky sometimes when you're under geared, but I don't know, we should be alright, I guess. Alright, I'm just gonna move because oh oh no. Ah, really? Big damage. Okay, it seems like we're going for the Necromancer first. It's fine by me. Otherwise, the Necromancer brings the other guy back as a ghost, which is annoying. That's probably the correct order then, because you know these guys will probably know. Oh. 
forecasters. <laughs> I feel really bad for them today. Maybe I'm getting the guy too far away and um, causing him to charge. But geez, nobody even died. Wow, that's pretty cool. Oh man, again, lovely boots on my pally. My pally's really undergeared. In fact, my mage and pally are both pretty undergeared. Oh! Wait, I'm talking nonsense. Pallies don't really need spell power if they're ret. Anyway. Why do those boots exist then? Maybe for healer pallies? I don't know. <laughs> All seems we're skipping. Fine by me. I'm not. Here for the reputation or anything. I'm not even here for the items apart from the last one. <sighs> oh, this is going to be a bit of a mess. Everyone. Yeah, I mean, if I can actually get, like, a bit more damage on my warrior, I think that'd be really good. Oh, man. Why are they running everywhere? Not an issue, it's just... Oh, missed that guy. Oh. Well, thankfully, we seem to have a really good healer, so, um, yeah. We don't die. <laughs> I charge in like a crazy person. This ice obviously is way trickier than it looks. Especially our um, warlock here is getting quite a lot of damage. And this will be interesting. Try not to face the dragon at these guys. It's probably going to drop off in a second. Pick him up. What? He's flying! <laughs> what? Dude, stop flying! <laughs> what the heck? Try not to swear on YouTube at all, because this doesn't do any good. Apparently, if you swear within the first five minutes of the video now, your whole video can be, like, demonetized. I mean, so much for the adult feature on a lot of YouTube videos. But yeah, I mean, sometimes I don't even edit videos and stuff, and if someone's sort of in a guild chat swearing or something, it can be a bit, bit of a problem. Like, oh, don't, don't swear. I don't mind swearing personally, it's just YouTube. <laughs> oh. Sweet, so it's just the boss now, which is going to be fun. Hey, everyone's faster than me. So again, when he explodes, you can hide behind the pillow, a pillar. This is like usually optional. I'm just gonna do it, man. Do it. I can disarm him. No.
is he going to drop the search needle ring and who's going to roll on it? I'm not going to change loot or anything. You can roar all you like, mate. Oh, this isn't too bad. Sorry. I know it's really kind of annoying when I move someone around when I don't have to. Like melee DPS and stuff, but... I'm going to hide. Yeah, get up, lazy bones. <laughs> Arise and carry out the master's will. I return a second chance to carve your spurs. I'm just gonna pop my shield wall. Not that I need it, but I kind of figured I might as well use it, right? Oh, that was a nasty shockwave. Well, I guess this is it. We'll see if the surge needle drops. Oh, God, everyone's taking a shed load of damage. Oi, face me, you silly thing. Oh, man. Oh. oh, wow. We got a ring, all right, but not for one we were looking for. See how much loot we get, guys. Okay, you might be interested. I'm going to take these things. I think a one. Oh, no, my inventory's full. Yes. I don't really need them, but that's five gold for me. Uh, okay, so we also get a bag, which I think my inventory is full. Can't see the bag. Maybe it'll be mailed to me. But the mail, the bag has about 30 to 50 gold in it. Yeah, I think I'm going to drop out from um, doing some of these now. Oh, another cool feature I love, guys. I so, I'm so thankful that Blizzard did this. Is when you complete, like, a dungeon or a raid, you get a little icon next to it that says that you've done it. Okay, that was cool. Um, yeah, I always set my half stone here. Um, I know there's other spots, but I kind of quite like this place, you know, for filthy animal. <laughs> Just like me. Moo. Moo, 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 etc. Have a good day, guys, and I'll speak to you soon.